My name is Holly Redfern and I am currently a first year business management and marketing student at Leeds Beckett University and this vlog is about my buying behaviour. Using Gosling and Richardson's business to customer decision making process, I'll explain how I came to make the purchase of this hoodie. This is a five step process. Step one is need recognition. This is deciding to obtain a new product and why I need it. I need the new hoodie going into the winter months that will keep me warm that will be also be seen as fashionable. I also like my hoodie to be versatile in how I can wear it as well as being high quality to last me a long period of time. This purchase will be seen as a limited problem solving as it is a less frequently made purchase with a more thought through process. It is a low to medium price purchase meaning it has limited risk and does not require a lot of money to be spent on it as well as having less research needed compared to buying a new piece of technology like a laptop. Step 2 is information search. With the use of a range of different techniques of online research using shopping websites and social media, I was able to compare a number of brands such as H&M, New Look and Topshop. These two areas are made influence on how I shop, allowing me to make purchases and browse products whether I'm at home or on the go. Using social media platforms like Instagram, I am able to find inspiration from friends, influencers like Hans and celebrities like Alexa Chung and Vanessa Hudgens, who I follow and see to relate to when it comes to my fashion choices. Doing so will be seen to have an ex external influence on how I shop, putting me into the category known as aspiring groups, which is defined as a subcategory of a reference group consisting of individuals not necessarily known personally but to whom a person desires to be associated with. Step three is evaluation of the alternatives. I do not have a lot of disposable income to spending on products such as clothes. This means that through the research I need to evaluate the cost of items in order to end up with high quality items whilst remaining within my budget. Through a rational decision making process, it will allow me to make a best decision in order to come out with a product I do not regret buying. This that will last me a long time and still be seen as appropriate in the following winter seasons, saving me having to spend more money on new items of clothing in the future. To do so, I compared items of clothing from brands like New Look, who are student budget friendly and have high quality items of clothing, Topshop, who have high quality items of clothing and are reasonably priced for a student, and H&M, who are a sustainable company with high quality clothes with, that are reasonably priced, offer student discount making the price even lower, saving me money as a student. This will be linked to Maslow's hierarchy theory of need theory, as making a purchase of a new item of clothing will fit into the level of the esteemed needs, the need that I feel to be respected by myself, family and my peers. Using H&M's clothing, I can reject an idea of myself told through the clothes I wear, while still getting the approval of those close to me. Step 4 is purchase slash product choice. H&M offered the best quality of clothing for me with a reasonable price tag fitting with my budget I'd set as a student as well as being able to view the items on display in store allow me to see the quality of clothing before purchase. This could be linked to the self-concept approach which is defined as the individual's belief about himself or herself including the person's attitudes and who and what the self is. This was said by Brewmeister in 1999. This is the belief that a customer is likely to buy from a certain company based on their values and how they relate to the buyer. For example, I am likely to shop at H&M due to the belief that they are a well-known sustainable brand and who believe in minimising the impl impacts they have on the environment in their production of sales and clothing. The fifth and final step is the post-purchase evaluation. I believe that this purchase was a great buy due to its affordability and versatility. Just like in the past, I believe H&M will always be a brand I compare with others when it comes to making new purchases through a wide variety of products and affordability. I do hope I have been helpful in understanding the business, to business buying purchase decisions.